Welcome back to Afternoon Break, capturing Savannah in a different light, or well, more accurately, the lack of light. These incredible paintings are all part of the Nocturnal Savannah series. And we are blessed today. We've got artist Bernard Nolan and gallery director Peter Roberts joining us in studio today to talk about these incredible works of art. Guys, thank you both for giving us a little bit of your time today. We sure. appreciate thank that. You, thank you. Uh, for starters, Bernard, uh, before we get into the paintings, talk to us a little bit about your career as an artist. What, what kind of drew you into art to begin with? Well, I came to SCAD. I w I've been doing art before that as a young guy. I was, I was doing art, but when I really got serious when I came here to Savannah and um, started painting and graduated with a BFA in painting and have continued on, and I graduated in 1998, so it's, okay. it's been a good road. I'd, I'd say it's worked out. You're looking at the, the skill here behind these paintings. Now, like we said, we've seen you know, paintings of Savannah. If you walk through this, you'll see a lot of daytime paintings of these, these landmarks. What, what inspired you to say, hey, let's, let's turn, the, turn the lights off here and look at Savannah from a different perspective? Well, art, it's, you know, architecture is my thing, as you can see. And Savannah is pretty in the daytime. We, we can't deny that. <laughs> but when, when it gets dark, it's just something clicks on in my brain. And, and that extreme dark and light creates a lot of depth for me. And, and um, somehow I'm attracted to that. <laughs> like a bug flying to a light. I like that. <laughs> yeah. I like that. Now, Peter, for your, when, you, when you're seeing the, these, this part of the series, what drew you to it, you know, looking at all these different works? Uh, his, the way that he captures sort of a sense of isolation, but also mm. independence, it's very, very mindful to me of a very famous American painter, Edward Hopper. Oh. So there's sort of this romantic quality, this very uh, historical quality, yeah. and timelessness to it. And it's all these places that we, we've all walked by a thousand times, but we're seeing them differently. Yeah, and I absolutely love it. Now, f for folks maybe not familiar with Savannah, I feel like you can tell pretty well what these are, but Bernard, walk us through a little bit of the paintings, what we've get captured in each of them here. So, Bull Street, the public artillery. Artillery, yeah. Um, I've never actually been in there. That's, I, I'm, in, I'm planning on going. <laughs> yeah, and, um, that's too funny. Been in the public, but uh, this is across from DeSoto and Savannah Theater on Chippewa Square, inside Pinky Masters, and then the one on the end is Bull, uh, let's see, Whitaker and Liberty. Liberty. Mm. And um, each of them does have significance uh, in a way. I mean, yeah. running around Savannah during college, and <laughs> there's a lot of memories tucked into these paintings. And, which not just me, but when I meet other people that see these, the same thing. They they've got memories as well. That's that's exciting. Mm. Where it can this be this full circle. Mm. Now I'm I'm curious myself. So when you're painting these, are you going out at nighttime? Are you setting up and just sitting there for hours, or what's that process look like? I photograph and bring it to the studio. Okay, okay. Yeah. So that way you don't have to sit out there in the middle of the night and. Good that. right. That's good. That's good to know. Now, the Nocturnal Savannah series, it's going to be displayed at Location Gallery. That's on Bull Street, of course. We mm -hmm. talked a little bit, Peter, about what, you drew to, what drew you to these, but what do you hope is going to draw other folks to these paintings, these little bits we've got to see so far today? Well, what we do at Location Gallery is uh, we pair up with a local nonprofit, that, and we kind of look at artwork that will fit that nonprofit's mission mm. because... Uh, Pro, the gallery profits from the show, the entire run of show, wow. go to a local nonprofit. And this one happens to be Historic Savannah Foundation, and it's very appropriate. These works, it's also Preservation Month in May. Mm -hmm. So it, it all it has all these layers to it. Yeah. And um, we're we're the fundraising arm for Corker and Austin Hill Realty, and Austin Hill is a chair of Historic Savannah. Mm. So it's all very, you know, circular. Yeah. And community oriented. And, you know, we've been doing this since 2016. And I think we just hit $160,000 wow. donated back to local nonprofits. That's amazing. All from selling art. That's amazing. And Bernard, I mean, did that draw you to the gallery, Bernard, knowing that your art would be going to help a great cause, be part of that? Definitely. The historic Savannah 
It's foundation. I mean, Savannah is a gem, mm -hmm. and it's because you know that's one of the reasons. Yeah. I love that. So guys, we want to make sure people can get out and see this artwork. Tell us when, tell us where, so everybody gets okay. an opportunity. So we open Friday, May 19th from 6 to 8 p.m. And the show runs at our main gallery through mid-June, mm -hmm. but everything is also viewable online at locationgallery.net. Okay, so great opportunity. It's nice that people got a good chunk of time to go in here, experience the artwork. Hopefully buy some, put it back on their walls. Well, and you should see art in person. It looks oh, better yeah. in person. I agree with you. Yeah. This, is, this is amazing stuff. As good as it looks on TV, uh, it'll look way better in somebody's home, I think, mm -hmm. down the road. Right. Thank you guys both so much for joining us today. Don't miss your opportunity to check out this amazing artwork for yourself. We've got all the details just in case you missed it, WTOC.com. We're not quite done with the afternoon break. If you're looking for a last minute meal for mom this weekend, we may have just